dental procedures that are commonly performed together to maintain oral health and prevent dental problems. Here's a detailed description of each procedure. 1. Oral prophylaxis. Oral prophylaxis, also known as a professional dental cleaning or teeth cleaning, is a preventive dental procedure performed by a dental hygienist or dentist. 1. It involves the removal of plaque, tatter, hardened plaque, and stains from the teeth, along with polishing the tooth surfaces for a smooth and clean finish. The process of oral prophylaxis typically involves the following steps. A. Examination. The dental professional will first examine your teeth and gums to assess their overall health. They may use a small mirror and dental explorer to check for any signs of tooth decay, gum disease, or other oral issues. B. Plaque and tatter removal. Using a small handheld instrument called a scalar or ultrasonic scalar, the dental professional will carefully remove plaque and tatter deposits from the tooth surfaces, especially around the gum line and between the teeth. The scalar is used to scrape off the buildup, and the ultrasonic scalar uses gentle vibrations and water to loosen and remove the deposits. C. Teeth polishing. After removing the plaque and tatter, the dental professional will use a special toothpaste-like substance called prophylaxis paste. This paste contains abrasive particles that help in polishing the tooth surfaces, removing any residual stains and leaving the teeth smooth and shiny. D. Flossing. The dental professional will then floss your teeth to ensure any remaining plaque or debris is removed from between the teeth and along the gum line. A. Rinsing and fluoride treatment. You will be asked to rinse your mouth to get rid of any leftover debris. In some cases, a fluoride treatment may be applied to strengthen the tooth enamel and protect against tooth decay. 1. Scaling. Scaling, also known as root planning, is a procedure specifically aimed at removing plaque, tatter, and bacteria from below the gum line and along the root surfaces of the teeth. 1. It is commonly performed as part of periodontal, gum, therapy for patients with gum disease or as a preventive measure for those at risk. The process of scaling typically involves the following steps. A. Numbing the area. If necessary, the dental professional may administer a local anesthetic to numb the gums and ensure your comfort during the procedure. B. B. Scaling. Using specialized dental instruments, such as ultrasonic scalers or hand scalers, the dental professional will carefully remove plaque, tatter, and bacteria from the root surfaces of the teeth and along the gum line. They will work below the gum line to eliminate any accumulated debris and smooth out rough areas on the roots to prevent further buildup and promote gum reattachment. C. Root planning. After scaling, the dental professional may perform root planning. This process involves smoothing the rough areas of the tooth roots to remove any remaining bacteria and provide a clean surface for the gums to reattach. D. Rinsing and follow-up care. Once the scaling and root planning are complete, your mouth will be rinsed to remove any debris. The dental professional may provide you with instructions for post-treatment care, which may include recommendations for proper oral hygiene practices and follow-up visits. Both oral prophylaxis and scaling are crucial in maintaining good oral health, preventing gum disease, and reducing the risk of tooth decay. It is, it is recommended to undergo these procedures regularly as part of your dental care routine, along with daily brushing, flossing, and routine dental checkups.